Ladies and gentlemen, we ask that you please rise for the presentation of the colors by our award-winning Air Force Junior ROTC Color Guard and for the Pledge of Allegiance led by the Student Council President, Dakota Calcaterra. We also ask that you remain standing for our senior choir members' presentation of our national anthem under the direction of Mr. Robertson. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. O'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in air. Flag was 
Please be seated. Thank you, Dakota, Mr. Robertson, and the senior choir members. Good evening, families and friends of the graduates of the class of 2022. As the senior class president, I've been given the honor to be the first to welcome you to the 56th annual commencement exercise ceremony. And honoring the Jackson Memorial High School class of 2022. <laughs> Please give a warm welcome to our honored guests present this afternoon. Superintendent of Schools, Mrs. Nicole Promelli. <laughs> Assistant Superintendent, Mr. Daniel Beginski. Assistant Superintendent, Mr. Robert Rotante. <laughs> Business Administrator, Board Secretary, Ms. Michelle Richardson. <laughs> Board of Education President, Mr. Michael Walsh. <laughs> Board of Education Vice President, Mrs. Tara Rivera. Board of Education members, Mrs. Allison Barakos, Mrs. Tina Cass, Dr. Erica Osman, Mr. Giuseppe Palmieri, Mr. Scott Sargent, Jackson Township Councilman, Councilman Alex Sawicki, and Councilman Andrew Kern. Jackson Memorial High School Principal, Mr. Kevin DiGenio. Jackson Memorial High School Assistant Principals, Mr. Dan McDevitt. Mrs. Heather Novak, and Mr. Thomas Tarver. <laughs> Director of Guidance, Mr. Kurt Holtz. <laughs> Supervisor of Special Education, Ms. Jennifer Carney. <laughs> Supervisor of Math and Science, Ms. Lori Henry. And class advisors for the class of 2022, Mrs. Anna Kafara and Mrs. Nancy Musavi. Good afternoon. 
afternoon and welcome families, friends, teachers, administrators, Board of Education, and a special welcome to my fellow graduates. Thank you all for having faith in me to represent and speak on behalf of the class of 2022. I am Brooke McCown and I've had the absolute privilege of serving as the class president for the past four years. If I'm going to be completely honest, I've been dreading writing this speech, partially because of senioritis, but mainly because I knew putting a pen to this paper meant we all would be finishing a very important chapter of our lives. This speech meant that it was truly the end of an era. It is surreal that today is the day when the majority of us say our final goodbyes to one another. The vast majority of us have stood side by side with each other for the past 12 years. But as we've been told before, all good things must come to an end. In case you haven't heard, the class of 2022 is kind of a big deal. The entire town knows who we are because we set the bar so high. Our goal was to recover and restart, and quite honestly, every single person here knows we did just that. We recovered and we restarted. Our class will go down in history as one of the most persistent, determined, and outstanding classes to ever walk these halls. Together, we elevated school spirit, exemplified academic excellence, and demonstrated high achievements in athletics. No one can deny this class is full of extremely hard workers, overachievers, and incredible leaders. We have not only exemplified ex excellence in the classroom, but resilience through our ability to adjust in difficult situations. As young adults, we understood that life is full of challenges, changes, and plenty of situations that may seem unfair. With that being said, we refuse to let any obstacle that stood in our way stop us. As a class, we restarted past traditions at Memorial that included the entire school. First was the tradition of homecoming week and the highly attended homecoming dance. We reestablished fan favorites like Powder Puff, the Studentverse faculty basketball game, Mr. JMHS, and the most celebrated Jaguar Nation. We started new events, which we hope will be our legacy, by becoming new traditions in personalizing of the senior parking spaces, hosting a freshman dance, and battle of the classes. It was our objective to bring memorable events to JMHS to elevate school spirit. We wanted high school to be a place of comfort, pride, and tradition for all students. In addition to the student activities, we have had one of the best athletic years in Jackson Memorial history. Just to list a few accomplish accomplishments, teams won overall state championships, state sectional titles, district titles, A South championships, the Ocean County tournament, the Shore Conference tournament, and some even won individual state titles and broke school records. The one I personally will always hold close to my heart is the girls basketball group four state sectional championship. The winning spirit will carry on. We want to thank our teachers, coaches, staff, and families for guiding all of us in the right direction. If it weren't for all of you, we wouldn't be here today. You all hold the strong, strong foundation where we built our individuality and became the young adults we are today. I want to give a very special thank you to our superintendent, Mrs. Primelli, and our principal, Mr. DiGinio, Ms. McCann, Mr. Piankowski, and the rest of our administration for your patience and belief in all of us. More specifically, to our class advisors, Mrs. Anna Kafera and Mrs. Nancy Musavi. You two stood side by side with all of us and watched us prosper into the young men and women we are today. Without both of you, we would not have been able to accomplish all the things we have these last four years. You two are truly the ultimate reason why high school was so enjoyable. Words can't describe the gratitude we all have for you, so thank you again. Jackson Memorial High School gave us more than what was in between the walls of the classroom. It gave us something better, the gift of friendships, relationships, laughter, tears, memories, and above all, it shaped us into who we are. For the vast majority, today is bittersweet because saying goodbye is just hard. But knowing that a new adventure awaits us all is exhilarating. There is no doubt in my mind we, the Jackson Memorial High School class of 2022, will not only succeed 
in our future endeavors, but thrive. As you re receive your diploma and flip over your tassels, know that today is just a spotlight of your hard work. Use today as a sign of celebration and motivation to carry on wherever life takes you. Whether you're moving on to further your education, making the brave decision to serve our country, or jumping right into the workforce, it is unquestionable that you will be able to overcome any barrier that stands in your way. Everyone told us that high school was going to be done in a blink of an eye, and quite honestly, they were right. Life is too short to care about what other people think. Do what makes you happy. Use your smile to change the world. Finally, on one last note, I want to thank you, the class of 2022, my peers, my friends, the ones I have stood shoulder to shoulder with for the last four years, for the trust you instilled in me. You trusted the elected senior class officers and me as your president to create your memories that will last your lifetime. I hope I made you all proud and served you well. It has been an absolute pleasure growing up with all of you. Congratulations, I'll see you all in 10 years at the reunion. Remember, once a JAG, always a JAG. Thank you. It is now my pleasure to introduce our superintendent of schools, Mrs. Nicole Primelli, to address the class of 2022. What an amazing speech. Good afternoon, everyone. This class of 2022 has grown up in a world that neither I nor I'm sure your parents could have even imagined when we were kids, and I'm not referring to the pandemic. Right around the time you were born, Mark Zuckerberg launched Facebook from his Harvard dorm room. When you were being potty trained, Twitter founder Jack Dorsey sent out the first tweet. When you hit kindergarten, these things called iPads were changing the world, and Instagram was born to make people like me and your parents, who just got a handle on Facebook, feel old instantly. And by the time you were allowed to have your own phone, you were dancing, singing, and posting on Musical.ly, which eventually became TikTok, and you were off, leaving us in the dust. While you were in school, exploring US history and algebra, NASA Spirit and Opportunity rovers were busy exploring Mars and finding evidence that Mars may once have been able to sustain life. And just before spring break, of your senior year, NASA's Hubble Space Telescope broke one of its own records by discovering the most distant star ever seen, a star whose light has taken 12.9 billion years to reach us. The astronomer and lead author of the paper of this discovery said, it was like scientists were reading a really interesting book, but started with the second chapter. And now we will have a chance to see it how it all got started. This is the way all of us here today feel about you. We are witnessing your stars as they blaze into our, your next mission. We are marveling at what you have overcome. You are resilient when you should not have to have been. You leaned on each other and your empathy and love for your fellow classmates shined as bright as a star again and again. I want to thank each and every teacher and administrator, every support, office staff member, food service, transportation, security, technology, and facility teams member, every staff member who supported you along your journey. We all share in this moment of pride with you. I want to thank your parents and family members who have been with you every step of the way. There is no greater satisfaction than watching you launch into your future endeavors as bright shining stars. Graduates, we are so excited to be celebrating all that you have accomplished and so eager to see you as you reveal to us what we know you're possible of through Life's Telescope. For you, technology is not new. It just is. Life-changing products and advancements are not unreachable. They happen every day. Discoveries that inspire awe are taking place right in front of you. Remember those Hubble scientists I mentioned? 
they called their new discovered star Irindel, which means morning star. That is said to hold promise for opening up an uncharted error. As I look out of you here today, I realize I couldn't have said it better myself. Good luck to you as you continue to shine and reach for the stars. I hope you recognize that nothing is impossible. The unimaginable is possible. Congratulations to the class of 2022. Thank you, Mrs. Primelli. Please welcome Mr. Michael Walsh, Board of Education President. Welcome. On behalf of the Board of Education, I would like to recognize you as the graduation class of Jackson Memorial High School. This is a completion of the first phase of your life filled with learning. I'd like to take a moment to thank all the people in the Jackson School community who have played a part in making this possible. The teachers, the support staff, the drivers, the facility crews, the food service, the security teams, all of those who have worked in front or behind the scenes to get you to where you are today. I am sure you would agree we could not have done it without them. Please give them some applause. For the last 12 plus years, you have learned to answer questions about what and how of life. Like, what is the capital of Nebraska? Or how does a Punnett Square work? In the next phase, you will learn the who, as in who you are and who you want to be. Will you be the one who gives or will you be the one who takes? Will you be the one who engages in life or will you be the one who stands on the sidelines and watches? I graduated from this school district in 1977. I spent 34 years as a teacher, a coach, and administrator. I have also volunteered for many community organizations, which include being a member of this Board of Education. I tell you this to encourage you to become a volunteer in your community, to help the next generations of students by using your experience and knowledge. Also, to help old, the older generation, you will learn new things from them. Why you should volunteer to enrich your education, to gain invol invaluable experience, and because it will make you feel good about yourself. Not to mention the fact that it looks uh, like a powerful networking tool and looks great on a resume. It also gives you a sense of purpose, helps you find opportunities, you never knew existed, and most importantly, you will be making a difference in the community. You'll be giving it back. Some of you here tonight have already experienced some of the benefits of volunteering through Key Club, Honor Society, and other clubs. We thank you for your efforts. I hope you have realized that you have made a difference in the community already. The Board of Education has worked hard alongside the administration, our teachers, our support staff to give you the best foundation we can. But the rest is up to you. Whether you volunteer at your school, with a local food pantry, with a group, church group, scouts, coaching youngsters, tutoring other students, or helping the elderly, it's important that you give back to your community in this process, you are setting an example for others to emulate. As someone who once sat where you are sitting now, I'd ask you to please remember that if you want to touch the past, touch a rock. If you want to touch the present, touch a flower. But if you want to touch the future, touch a life. 
I am confident that the amazing class will do just that. And I am doing so you will be using your passions and interests to make a difference. I promise the experience you will discover who you are and we can't wait to see the future you will create. Congratulations to class of 2022. Thank you, Mr. Walsh. At this time, I would like to introduce Mr. Kevin D. Junio, principal of Jackson Memorial High School, to introduce the 2022 salutatorian and valedictorian. Thank you, Brooke. This year's salutatorian completed 11 AP courses and challenged herself in our rigorous STEM Academy at Jackson Memorial. She's a member of multiple honor societies and has maintained her strong academics along with being a varsity athlete. In the community, she volunteered in the healthcare field and plans on pursuing a career in biology or medicine while attending the University of South Carolina. I am proud to introduce the 2022 salutatorian, Ms. Kate Bryant. Thank you, Mr. DiEugenio. Good afternoon, family, friends, teachers, staff, and the graduating class of 2022. I want to thank all of our families and mentors for being here every step of the way, guiding us, and supporting us to make it to this day. It is my honor to be standing here before you all. To be honest, my journey here was far from easy with numerous ups and downs, but I would not have done my high school career any other way. The STEM Academy granted me various opportunities to excel in my academics and encouraged me to strive for the best in everything I do. The Academy opened doors for me to take advanced classes to boost my GPA and exposed me to various subjects that I can apply to my career in the future. Next, I want to thank some of the faculty that got me here. First, I would like to start off with Senora Cafera. She believed in me even when I did not. I know I am not one of the only students she has impacted since she has been so involved in every step of the way, but I think I could speak for most of us. She has truly helped in making our high school experience memorable. As you may know, I have been involved in the athletic programs at Jackson Memorial. The varsity coach of the girls' soccer program, Mr. Beha, or as I know him, and anyone else involved in athletics as just Beha, has been a constant figure in my life since the summer before freshman year. Beha has allowed me and every athlete he's interacted with to have fun and not take life as seriously. To the class of 2022, we have been through quite a lot. For most of us, it feels like we should still be in sophomore year. However, we made the best of the short time we were given. Our classic spirit and enthusiasm has prevailed and we have remained resilient and positive even in the eye of the storm. To keep this brief, I want to leave all of you with a quote from John D. Rockefeller. Don't be afraid to give up the good to go for the great. I hope that all of you leave here feeling inspired to do great things in the future. Thank you. I would now like to present the valedictorian of the class of 2022. This year's valedictorian possesses a 5.0 grade point average, was part of our Science, Technology, and Engineering Academy. He served as president of the National Honor Society and Math Honor Society. He was accepted into the New Jersey Governor's School of Sciences. His participation in the Key Club, Interact Club, allowed him to volunteer his time to give back to the Jackson community. A varsity letter winner on the Jaguar volleyball team, I am proud to introduce this year's valedictorian ranked number one in the class. He's attending a seven-year program at the University of Pennsylvania of Dentistry at Villanova University this fall. Our valedictorian of 2022, Nicholas Tazi.
Thank you, Mr. DG Neo. Good afternoon, administrators, advisors, teachers, parents, friends, and the graduating class of 2022. I am honored to address you all as your valedictorian today. When I was first deciding on where to attend high school, I was between several options. I did not go to Getz like the majority of my classmates, but rather a small Catholic school. To this day, I have never regretted my decision to attend the Jackson Memorial High School STEM Academy. Throughout my transition to a much larger environment, I have met so many amazing friends, teachers, and advisors who have helped me grow as an individual and achieve my goals. As a class, we have accomplished so much in terms of academia and athletics, despite adversity and the challenges we faced along the way. We've each made our own ripples and altered the tide here at JMHS through our individual and collective achievements. This success and resilience proves that we have the potential to make tremendous change in our futures. Through an ocean of chaotic change, we've gained strength that has brought us together. Everything that we've experienced in high school and each setback that we've encountered has made us more prepared for life and able to better adapt to difficult situations. It is evident through their daily work that the teachers at this school truly take the time to allow every student to succeed and learn, and that their teaching extends far beyond the classroom. I would like to take the time to personally thank Mrs. Russo, Ms. Bunce, Ms. Kirschenbaum, and Mrs. Saltman for all the opportunities they presented to me throughout high school and for shaping me into the person that I am today. I want to thank all of my friends for always being there for me whether that means calling each other during essentially all hours of the night to help one another out with projects or just to talk, or constantly being there for each other whenever needed. Lastly, I would not be here without my parents, who were always my biggest supporters and encouraged me to succeed, as well as my twin sister, Stephanie Tazi, who is graduating today as well. Looking back on my initial decision of where to attend high school, I realized how impactful our choices can be. All of my decisions along the way brought me to where I am today. As of right now, our futures are a sea of uncertainty and a multitude of unknown choices. It is up to you to take risks and make a ripple in the tides through your decisions. In the words of Albert Einstein, a ship is always safe at shore, but that is not what it is built for. Moving forward, remember that rough tides will always ebb. Never regret past decisions, but rather, Learn from them as you advance in life and choose to take the risks necessary to succeed. Congratulations and best of luck, class of 2022. Well done, Nick, and again, congratulations. Again, my good afternoon, Jackson Township. The heart and soul of our school is our dedicated teaching staff. I would like to recognize this year's Teacher of the Year, who runs our Jackson Jaguar Marching Band. Please give a round of applause for our Teacher of the Year, Mr. Jason Diaz. I would also like to recognize our Support Staff Member of the Year. She works with our special needs students as a paraprofessional. Proud to introduce Ms. Michelle Sheeran. <laughs> Class of 2022, this is your journey. In September, September of 2018, when you first entered the halls, as eager freshmen, you probably had a lot of ideas, a lot of expectations of what your journey of four years would be like. Throughout ninth grade, you guys were driving in first gear on an open road to success. At stops, you collected new friends and experiences, academic skills, and extracurricular talents that helped you navigate your first year. You learned how to adjust to new surroundings in crowded hallways and unexpected twists and turns that were all part of your freshman year. Sophomore year, a little different. You were ready to take the second leg of high school. This adventure, big dreams, big successes in the classroom, on the athletic fields, and on our stages became fo into focus. Shifting into second gear, you used your skills to travel the academic freeway through harder classes and bigger opportunities. 
you were gaining ground as movers and shakers, class leaders, and you saw all the different and unique roads and pathways that JMHS had to offer. You were moving along, now more confident, more rounded, as you went through your turns of your sophomore year. And then almost in an instant, you hit the brakes as the road suddenly closed in March of 2020. 2020. For a moment, you were idling in neutral, wondering when we'd get back to normal. It was an unexpected detour into an unknown tunnel. The class of 2022 turned on their high beams, drove on, but things would be very different for the rest of that year. As junior year began, the journey began with lots of starts and stops. Red, green, yellow lights challenged us. It challenged us all. It was anything but smooth sailing. At times, the journey was unfair, unpleasant, and downright depressing. You put your wipers on, you drove on, and you made it through a stormy junior year. You were determined. Rocky roads didn't stop you from traveling the JMHS road to success. You traveled in third gear through AP classes, through SATs, academic honors, championship sports seasons, and award-winning performances. You stayed apart for a good part of your junior year while sticking together. 420 Jaguars created an atmosphere that was tolerant, patient, and understanding, even after it was what was a tough and uncertain junior year. You put in the work, whether in person or remote, and you were ready for the last leg of your journey that would be your senior year. You sped out of the tunnel, ready for the road bumps of the past in your review mirrors, and success was in your view. Your engines were revved up and you were ready to make up for a lost time. Your class took the monumental task of restarting old traditions and making new. Your journey included Friday night football, Jaguar Nation, painted parking spots, spirited powder puff games, and a homecoming dance. Mr. JMHS and fun and entertaining spirit weeks. Class President Brooke McGowan, Class Officers Bella Mahabir, Elizabeth Jacoby, Megan Barna, Philip William and Eric Ebay all went above and beyond with superior leadership and communication to make this unique journey one to remember for all the right reasons. Students were recognized in state competitions, national competitions, including Noel Powers, who finished as a top DECA student in the world. Class of 2022, you've officially reached your goal and your destination along the road to success at JMHS. Now it's time to fasten your seatbelts for the next trip. Some of your next destinations include William & Mary, University of Chicago, University of South Carolina, University of Michigan, Stevens Institute, Rutgers University, Virginia Tech, Clemson, Villanova, and many other top tier colleges and universities. I would also like to publicly recognize and ask to stand the six students who will be defending our country, serving the United States Armed Forces. Please stand, those students. Thank you for your service. I am confident that your journey through Jackson School District has prepared you for the speed bumps, the storms, the detours, the twists and turns, and road closures that may lie ahead. Take a few trips off the beaten path to learn something new. Navigate your future safely with care for others. And it's my hopes that at some point your journey brings you right back here to share your successes. Because all of you are once a JAG and always a JAG. Thank you. The time has now come for you, the class of 2022, to accept your well-deserved recognition as graduates by receiving your diplomas. First row, please stand. In keeping with the tradition of commencement, the valedictorian and salutatorian will be the first in the class to receive their diplomas, followed by the class officers and the rest of the class of 2022. Valedictorian, Nicholas Tazi. Salutatorian. Kate Bryant. Hi, 
I would now like to call Ms. Gaffar and Ms. Musavi to the microphone to introduce the class advisors for their diplomas. Ms. Primelli, if you could please assist. Senior Class President, Brooke Elizabeth McCown. <laughs> Senior Class Vice President, Isabella Joy Mahabir. Senior Class Executive Board Member, Megan Alexandra Barna. <laughs> Senior Class Executive Board Member, Eric Akina Ebay. <laughs> Senior Class Executive Board Member, Elizabeth Jacoby. Senior Class Executive Board Member, Philip Robert Williams III. <laughs> Student Council President, Dakota J. Calcaterra. Jose Abarca Hernandez. Diana Cross. Anthony V. Abenizio. Alexis Lynn Lacey. Sophia Adler. Stephen Laskowitz. Nicholas Afanador. Elliot Latch. Dominic Ajamian. Kyle Laverty. John Axon. Chloe Angelica Lawler. Zania Rurola Alau. Michelle Lazaro Orozco. Ryan Alessio. Jason LaFonte. Dylan Ali. Rebecca Ann Lewis. Javid Nazir Ali. Jing Wen Lin. Christopher J. Allen. Justin Linali. Denzel Alia. Destin Lola. Haley Ann Alu. Charlize Lopez. David J. Amador. Emily Lloyd. Amanda Marie Ammerman. Ava Grace Lombardi. Emily M. Anderson. Santo Lopiccolo. Jacqueline Angelis. Lauren M. Lucky. Rachel Aniello. Mino Luthra. Mateo Aponte. Megan Madretsky. Dominic Brian Arcella. Aliza Mahmood. Ryan Michael Aletto. Dua Mahmood. Jessica Ayad. Gia Maldonado. Steven Beto. Sabrina Marcheca. 
Kiara Ball. Matthew Marino. Christian Bamman. Dana Marazzo. Emily Elizabeth Barker. Amanda L. Martin. Morgan Barnaby. Manolis T. Matthew Dacus. Catherine Barnes. Jamari Marcus McBean. Jonathan Paul Bartley. Kara McBride. Janessa Nathalia Badilli. Ethan McCabe. Chase Lee Baum. Zachary McCabe. Emily Beadle. Kyle Matthew McCaffrey. Emily Bead, oh, Shane Bender, sorry. <laughs> Shane Joseph McDevitt. Gianna M. Benjamin. Tamia Josephine Daniela McEwen. Isabel Rose Benner. Kaylee Ann McGinnis. Emily Elise Beal. Joseph E. McGowan. Masaki S. Bingham. Everett McKelvey. Emily Bodimer. Alexander Meadows. Oscar O. Bonilla. Damian Mendez. Aiden A. Borden. Christopher Mendoza. Morgan Schuyler Boyko. Kathleen Mesquita. Dylan Jagger Brem. Ryan J. Messenger. Michael G. Brembos. Bella Miller. Joshua Brown. Faith Lily Minazzi. Kimo Burgos Bowers. Caitlin Miranda. Ashley S. Cabrera. Marissa N. Mobley. Edgardo Cabrera. Marla Mamperus. Jasmine Cadet. Jasper Owen Morell. Elizandro Calvo Aguilar. Kayla Elizabeth Moyer. Sage J. Campos. Taina Muhammad. Aiden Cancellieri. Logan Murphy. Vincent Anthony Cancellieri Jr. Alexa Nagy. Zachary Michael Canzano. Jaira Emma R. Navarro. Julia Ray Caperso. Allison Joan Nealon. Sophia Carpentero. Devin James Nevels Jr. 
Andre Carter. Ryan Noble. Christopher Kartnick. Ashlyn Veronica Nolan. James Kassane. Emily Noviello. Alexander Castlebor. Christian Novoa. Jason M. Casper. Crystal Nunez. Tara Castiglia. Abigail Lynn O'Connell. Beverly E. Cavico. Hannah O'Connor. Yeah. Ellie A. Cavico. Kayla Michelle Agno. Scylla Selleck. Alexa Olson. Andrew Sanamo. Hunter Olson. Brandon K. Chan. Haley J. Ordino. Tyler Charzuski. Michael Orientali. Amadea Cipriano. James Robert Osmond. Kayla Ryan Sapoli. Paige E. Oswald. Jordan Clark. Logan Otto. Megan Ruth Culinary. Mason Palace. Mia Collins. Dominic Palmasino. Yeah. Corey Conklin. Gabriella Panabianco. Courtney L. Kuhn. Chiro Panella. Claudio Capola. Robert Panicu. Joseph Catronio. Alyssa Pauline A. Paranal. Rachel Kroom. Aaron Patel. Zachary Crotchfelt. Harshal M. Patel. Randy Enrique Cruz. Rohan Patel. Dean Daddio. Andrew Vincent Patiri. Alyssa D'Angelo. Dominic Patty. Katherine Dansky. Natalie Pierce. Edward Danza III. Isabella Michelle Penna. Lucas F. Dom. Aurelis Marie Perez. Jake Davis. David Lionel Peaton. Mark Davis. Emma Victoria Petco. Taylor Diane Davis. Destiny R. Phillips. Jamar Manuel DeBerry. Alana Picciato. Cameron Reese DeHart. Christina M. Portera. Kayla DeJesus. 
Samantha Porto. Ethan David Dembinski. William Vincent Posa. Matthew DeRosa. Noel Kathleen Powers. John Reed Devine. Kyle Prusak. Layla Jewel DeVito. Victoria O. Pangelo. Nicolette DeVito. Corey Devin Pushko. Daniela B. Diaz. Mason Jordan Qualiano. Antonia Nicole DiBernardo. Brendan Ragel. Diana Rose DiMaggio. Moeed Rahil. Javon Dixon. Ria Rampersad. Hayden Drop. Joshua Rand. Andrew Drury. Livia M. Regal K. Kiras. Bridget Francis Dunn. Reese T. Rosinski. Troy Dunn. Jordan C. Rathbauer. George Ebid. Michael Rausch. Teresa Elaine Ettery. Alexa Marie Rayner. Justin Ray Ellers. <laughs> Kenneth Reed. Julia Eidenberg. Elias Michael Reeves. Liam L. Sophia Rega. Adam Elholy. Araya Riddick. Austin Eli. Trevin Rieger. Brianna Fairchild. Christian Robert. Kylie Farley. Taylor Jean Robinson. Nicholas Fauci. Andrew Ginsburg Rodriguez. Brandon Federigo. Jonathan Roche. Take this. Amelia Renee Federovich. Madison Rocks. Maxwell S. Feld. Zay Roldan. Haley Fernandez Bryan. Alexander Roman. Kalea Fitch. Anaya L. Rosado. Kalea Fitch. Troy Rubio. Kira Lynn Flows. Samantha Grace Russelesi. Trevor Flows. Samuel J. Russo. Nicole Amanda Flores. Rhea Saini. Devin Fodorero. Samantha R. Sampson. 
Emily Ann Fogarty. Desiree Sams. Gabriella M. Fortunato. Brandon Michael Santor. Jessica Rachel Foster. Patrick Sawicki. Gianna Franco. Gavin Xavier Squatchker. Angelica Froyo. Tony Skyer. Luis Fuentes. Allison E. Senes. Erin Gaffney. Damian Shafik. Julia Gagliano. Nyla Shakeb. Yasel Galliana. Liam Shero. Alfonso Gambino. Samantha Shakes a Day. Angelique Noel Garced. Kayla Sherman. Delaney Ray Rose Garretson. Cami S. Shusha. Brandon Angel Gatchel. Jessica Nicole Speck. Aiden Giorgiano. Sadeen M. Siddiqui. Christine Giatino. Joseph Daniel Silverman. Sierra Gilberti. Paul J. Simos. Ellie Gilmore. Subira Simon. Alexander Jaloshi. Christopher Sirico. Justin Ian Glazier. Athonius G. Skyas. Caitlin Elizabeth Glushko. Madison Grace Skratsky. Sage Goki. Olivia Isabel Scavernina. Alex Angel Gomez. Skylar Rain Smith. Jaden Gazinski. Daniel Smock. Aaron Grasso. Matthew R. Smock. Natalie Amina Rose Grasso. Stefano Solano. 
Adriana Greco. Monica Sousa. James Guerrero. Matthew Spencer. Sado R. Gerzakovic. Lily Marie Spinelli. Jamie Habanowski. Matteo Spinelli. Matthew Hamdi. Rebecca Lynn Springfield. Ali Harkowski. Adriana Squayo. William Harkowski. McKenna Riley Stalker. Alexander Davis Harmon. Sean Stalker. Charles Harrison. Abigail Rose Stanberry. Matthew George Harluck. Emily Stern. Gianna Mary Beth Headley. Jennifer Stowasser. Paige Marie Hentz. Fala Suleiman. Sydney Morgan Herbstman. Caitlin Rose Sullivan. Isaac Alexander Hernandez. Christopher Sweeney. Molly Hewitt. Harrison Jupiter Swindell. Justin Hirsch. Ricardo Cipher. Alex Hobbs. Delaney Thomas. Jaden Holmes. Taylor and Celestine Thomas. Sarah Howe. Zandre Thompson. Sierra Reddick. You scared me. James Tobin. Bridget Huddy. Joseph D. Tomes. Zachary Inzatari. Liam Jared Torsha. Madison Ann Jacobs. Joseph Toscano. Sydney A. Jakes. Jaden Touche. Nia Johnson. Daniel J. Tolan. 
Jade Jones. Stephanie Marie Tazi. Julian Joseph. Jacob Evan Treat. Anthony Joyner. George D. Tremblay. Emily Kalen. Brandy Lynn Von Brunt. Ryan R. Cass. Victoria Vicinio. Jordan Katz. Brianna Marie. Alves Villarino. Jason Kaufman. Alyssa Villava. Aliyah Viola Kalis. Anthony Viola. Madison Kearns. Isabella Viverito. Alyssa Catherine Kelleher. Megan Christina Wachtowitz. Blaze Kelly. Evan Wallenty. Hannah Lynn Kelly. Victoria Elizabeth Walsh. Kaiser R. Kelly. Samantha R. Weisselberg. Thomas Kendrick. <laughs> Kajan Westbrook. Matthew Wyatt Kennedy. Michaela Whitehill. Benjamin Kenyon. Thomas Wadowski. Jessica Klein. Amber Charlotte Anastasia Williams. Madison Trixie Kologi. Kayla Wilson. John Francis Kaprevich. Simone Tylea Winston. Ryan Thomas Korinchek. Sophia Shaw. Allison Kosman. Catherine Alyssa Yalsh. Maya Kaziski. Annabella Gianna Yates. 
David M. Krochko. Amaris Yunus. Kelly M. Kuhn. Peter Zamichelli. Emily Kylan. Donovan Zapata. Yeah, that's Emily. I said her name already. No. Go. Brian Zapian. Thomas Zay. Emma Grace Zenobia. Miriam Zidane. Miranda Zona. Big, big round of applause for the class of 2022. <laughs> Mrs. Permelli, Mr. Walsh, and members of the Jackson Board of Education, as principal of Jackson Memorial High School, I, Kevin DiEugenio, present to you the class of 2022, and I certify that the eligible young men and women before you You're have fulfilled the graduation yeah, requirements set forth by the State of New Jersey and the Jackson Township Board of Education. Class of 2022, please stand. You have earned, you've earned the right of shifting the tassel on your cap from the right to the left, and I hereby officially recognize you as graduates of Jackson Memorial High School. Congratulations. Families and friends, thank you for joining us. Have a great afternoon.